EKU leaders say they're interviewing persons of interest as they try to figure out who's responsible for a threatening message found on campus. The university canceled classes for the rest of the week and moved tonight's EKU football game to Georgetown College. And there's extra security on hand for that game. Garrett Weimer is live for us in Georgetown with our top story at 6. Garrett. There's a heavy police presence out here now. Several different agencies out and about. We've even seen a K-9 unit uh, out here checking cars. But don't let the orange you see around the field here fool you. It's less than an hour now until EKU plays a home game here at Toyota Stadium in Georgetown. I go to about every game, and I'm not going to miss one for any reason. <laughs> Some fans showed up nearly four hours early trying to make it a home game away from home. We're going to make it their home stadium today, so it's going to, it's going to be fun. We're going to fill this place up. It's important just to show that we're one family, one, uh, one university still, um, just trying to come out and support them because they've been playing real well. Fans were ready and so was security. We're told extra security measures will be put in place for the game. EKU President Michael Benson spoke to us this afternoon on campus. He says he hopes for a big crowd here tonight. Sports, of course, is uh, in many ways a microcosm of, of a campus and a society. And uh, these young men represent the university. The team represents uh, EKU. And we're pulling for them, just like we're pulling for our campus. Now, administrators recognize moving the team's home game here is tough, and they have called for a blackout tonight, so they say they hope to see a lot of black in the stands here supporting the EKU Colonels. Live in Georgetown, Garrett Weimer, WKYT. Garrett, thank you. No arrests have been made in connection to the threat, but EKU is offering a $10,000 reward in the case. Police say they'll continue extra patrols on the EKU campus while students are away for fall break.